What's up guys, we are back today with my Ultimate 300ZX build. Um, it's been a couple days actually, but I had to wait for some parts, had to order some things. Um, today I have R35 coil pack brackets from Polar Engineering that I'm going to be installing. Um, I actually had these installed previously. I've been running the R35 coil packs for about two years now. They have been flawless. I highly recommend it. You get rid of the old 30 year old ignition system. You get rid of the 30 year old PTU. Don't have to worry about it. It's a new ignition system. Odds of failure are much less. I did fuck up a little bit. <laughs> and when I put all this together, I realized that I had some springs laying here that were actually for my variable timing control. So I did all that off camera because there's no point in doing stuff twice on camera. It's kind of pointless. So. Anyways, I suck. Um, this is the valve cut or the intake manifold we got going on from Merlin Machining. Um, I went ahead and threw the valve or the throttle bodies on the other day because I was really bored. Um, these are actually 65 millimeter throttle bodies, which are up from my old Rob Z throttle bodies, which were 62 millimeters. Um, they worked awesome. I have no complaints about them. I did struggle a little bit with getting the drivability down with the tune and the idle set. But yeah, hopefully maybe we'll be able to get this on today. I do need to redo my brake booster line and fit these throttle cables in for the dual throttle bodies. Day three, I'm really taking my time here. Been working only probably like three, four hours at a time on this. For today, I got the gas pedal out of the car. Gonna work on getting this. And this little guy right here has to be moved over to the new throttle linkage, which I have in the car. Oh, yes, a couple other little small things I had to have done. So I did pull the intake manifold off. Throttle position sensor swapped over from the factory intake manifold. Um, I was able to bolt it on there. I'm actually going to have to end up either swapping the wires around or flipping a switch in the hall tech, which I'm just going to end up doing that. There's no reason to do anything else. Got my 5 bar map sensor plumbed in. These two ports I can't even actually use because they are in the way of my coil packs. So that's it. This is the throttle cable that we're dealing with here. I got one for each side. I'm gonna have to set the length. Like I said, I gotta get the throttle cable, throttle, the gas pedal put in, and then modify these as needed. Basically, this unscrews right there and then this whole piece slides up and down and I just cut to length and that's it call it a day oh yes one other thing I was carrying this around I completely forgot to mention it I have all ash spec charge piping intake piping and unfortunately a lot of the piping comes with these little bungs this one over here is actually off of my driver's side turbo set like that it's going to go back in place, but obviously I'm going to paint it. I got it sanded down right now. But there was a bun right there that went up to go into the PCV system for the PCV valves and whatnot. Um, I'm not going to run a PCV system on this. I got breathers, dash 10 a.m. to the catch can. That should be plenty. Uh, maybe one day I'll run a vacuum line to the catch can. But for now, it is what it is. It'll be all right. I'm going to repaint this, reinstall this as well today, hopefully. Fingers crossed that this will be running by the end of today. Alrighty, let's get to it.
I am back working on this thing. What I'm going to do today is actually clean up some of these, the charge piping that I've had in this car for a while now. I'm actually going to reuse the Ash spec two and a half inch intake and charge piping. But for now, as you can see, these pipes are uh, a little on the rough side. The paint's kind of wearing off after five, u five years of being removed and put back on. I get to it. Uh, waiting on a couple more little fittings to come in. I'm going to redo some of the hoses over here for my brake booster and map sensor. And then we should be all set, ready to go. Turn this light on. Oh, all right, there we go. Wait, we get some light. Set this bad boy up right here. Bam. Look at that. Give him a quick scuff and shoot. Wait a second. Something is missing. 